Welcome back. So next up, we have a tech issue that I am not yet aware of. It's something that our viewer wanted to keep on the down low, but our tech host, Romaine, is going to fill us in. Hey, Romaine, how's it going? I'm good, Catherine. How are you? I'm good, but, you know, I'm so kept in the dark here. Fill me in on yes, what's going on. Yes, well, um, basically what happened is I received an email from a viewer who okay. uh, wanted to keep things a little bit on the down low, as they say, okay. or remain anonymous. Okay. But after reading uh, his email, mm -hmm. uh, I felt like this is something that we all go through, and it's not an isolated issue. So you wanted I think, to share it for the greater good of yes, mankind. Yes, definitely, definitely. Okay. So um, to all the right. viewer out there, I hope that you don't mind. I'm going to be reading this, uh, but again, it's just for the benefit of all of us. All of us. So here's his email. For the past couple of months, I've been having trouble making it last. I've tried everything and nothing seems to work. It's getting to the point where my girlfriend gets mad because I'm never available when she needs me. But she doesn't seem to understand that when she's not around, I have nothing else better to do than to use it to keep myself occupied. I've even asked some of my friends and they seem to be having the same issue. I have even considered not using it anymore. Please let me know what I can do to make my cell phone battery last longer. Oh, cell phone battery. Okay, okay. What did you? No, that's what that's what I thought. I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's page. okay. Yep, All okay. Right. Cool. So as you can see, like this is something that's poses a problem to everybody. I mean, right. I have trouble making it last myself. We all do. You know? <laughs> so what I've done is actually come up with a few uh, tips on how you can make your cell phone battery actually last longer. Perfect. Let's get into all it. Right. Cool. But before I get into that, like, do you ever notice when you first get a cell phone? Yes the battery seems to last for like weeks on end without oh, charging yeah. it, right? Oh, yeah, so much better than your old Yeah, phone, it's like, right? wow, this is great, yeah. man. I, I, yeah. I made the right choice and everything like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But course. after a while, it's like... Same old, same Yeah, old. it takes like three or four charges yeah. just to make a phone call. Yeah, right? exactly. So as, as time goes on, batteries do tend to die off and right. lose their lifespan, right. which is natural. But there are a few things we can do in order to uh, help us Extend make it last it. longer. Perfect. You know, give it some longevity, as they say. <laughs> great. Okay? But uh, the first thing I'm going to do before I get into the actual tips okay. is actually uh, explain to you uh, what happens to a battery if you don't charge it properly. Okay. Okay. So in order to charge a battery properly, this is something I suggest you do maybe once or twice a month at okay. least. Okay? okay. And this is totally killing your battery. And I know I don't it's like hard. I don't like the sound of that. Okay, that means you, I have to turn off exactly. my phone and okay. I can't use it no at Facebook, all. No Facebook, no Twitter. No BBM. Exactly. Okay. Aww. But once or twice, it won't hurt you. Okay. You can actually right. sleep in if you want to. Do it on a weekend. Okay, okay, okay I like that. All right. Sounds so good. what you do is totally let let battery die until the phone turns off. Okay. All right, and keep it off and then put it to charge. Okay. Okay. Now if you don't do this, I'm going to show you what happens. Uh -oh. Okay. I, I brought a few things here. A few little props yes. here. We're not going to do arts and crafts. This is just to uh, uh, demonstrate the battery. Just okay. Just raw business at Tech ER. <laughs> yes. All right. So for example, let me move this out of the way there so okay. you can see. So let's say, for example, this is your battery brand new. Okay. okay. The water represents the life battery in the battery. Life. Okay? okay. Now, this is at 100%. Okay. Okay. Now, if after a while we, we don't charge the battery from the, the, the just bottom. being the bottom done, okay? Right. What's going to happen is the battery is going to eventually become, a portion of the battery will become unusable. It's going to become okay? jello, everyone. Yeah. All right. So <laughs> this is represented by jello, yes. Okay. Now, you can't eat it because, you know, you know it's battery. It's battery, so but anyways. Gross. All right. So. <laughs> This is actually what happens. Now, there okay. are batteries that have fixed this problem. Okay. You know, the scientists out there, kudos to you guys for uh, fixing this issue for us. You're on but it. But eventually, over time, the lifespan of the battery does die. Okay. So what happens now is you won't be able to use that 10% or 20% of the battery. Okay. And then actually, you're just filling up like 80%. So this would be what would happen if I didn't let my battery yes. die all the way and just charge it from, you know, like exactly. another so point. Exactly. So eventually, you're actually oh only gosh. using 80% of what the battery is actually capable of holding. Seriously, that's crazy. Okay. I never would have guessed that. Yeah, so wow. there we have it. So make sure you try and do that maybe once or twice a month. Okay. Uh, and that'll give your battery um, a lot longer Optimum life. Optimum performance. Yeah, exactly. So, right. you know, you don't want the jello in right. the battery. Okay, okay. no jello. All right. Jello's bad in this so, case. Needless to say, you know, batteries do only last maybe three or four days anyway. Right. Um, but again, what we can do, especially these days, everybody has a smartphone. Yeah. I mean, I have a Blackberry. I, have I believe one. you have one as well. Everyone who's anyone has one. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, I mean, there's no, nothing we could do about that. No, they yeah. do take up a lot of battery. More all right? energy. Right. So what we could do is actually do things like turn off the Bluetooth. Okay. Okay. Turning off the Bluetooth ensures that um, it's not sending out any extra radio signals. Right. In addition to what it already does to make phone calls and okay. whatnot. So what's actually better for that is actually maybe a uh, cordless. Okay. Or, sorry, corded. 
headset. Oh, it's gone Just something right like here. this. I know it may not perfect. look as cool as the Bluetooth. Yeah, definitely but not as cool. It but... certainly saves the battery life. All right. Okay? okay. So that's something else you can do as well. Okay. And turning off the Bluetooth um, as well as like the Wi-Fi, maybe the GPS, yep. things like that also drain the battery the as well. The extra features. Okay. Okay, cool. Now, another thing you can do now I know you love to do this, yeah. All which right. is these key tones, okay? So when you press a button, it makes a funny noise or something like that. All right, I like my noises on yes, my phone. Yes, I know, but you, you don't need it. No, you it's really not. don't. It's unnecessary. So turn it off. Bells and whistles. Exactly, and that'll okay. you know that'll that'll save you some battery life as well. It's a good place In to start. In addition to that, one thing that actually does drain a lot of your battery, and a lot of people don't know out there, right. is actually the vibrate setting. No way, my phone's yes. always on vibrate. Yes, I know you're probably in class or yeah. in a meeting. You at still work, want to on work, to, yeah. you want to check your calls. Oh. But having it on vibrate takes a lot of your battery life up. Really? I never would have guessed. Okay. Okay. So that's one thing you want to do that's a good as well. Tip. All okay? right, sounds good. Now, there's a feature on a lot of the smartphones. Mm -hmm. I have it on my BlackBerry. Okay. Uh, it's actually the auto shut off feature. Yes, I have it. Now, heard it's, of it's actually really, really good. So yeah. before you go to bed at night, um, you know, you turn off you turn off your phone. Yeah. It says auto shut off and shut on, actually. Right, right. So add okay. that there to it. Okay. Um, so you designate the time as to when your phone will be turned off okay. and when it'll turn on automatically. Okay. All right. And right there, as you can imagine, if it's off, you know, it's not being used at all. Right. right? right. So it'll turn on automatically. For me, I set it like 7.30. That's when I wake up in the morning. Okay. And it's ready to go. And sometimes I don't even have to charge it that day just because right. I save that extra couple hours Smart. by turning it off overnight. Ah, oh, you're uh, really thinking here. I'm all trying. Right. I'm okay. trying. All right. What else you got for me? Also, what you could do. Um, now, I know it's a big thing out there. I know you people out there see those commercials, you know, text 5523 and get the new Kesha song for your ringtone. All right? Those are huge. Those Everybody are big. Likes Everybody's those. seen those. Yeah. I've been a sucker to them a couple times we before. All have. We all but have. what I've come to realize is that they drain your battery. The MP3 ringtones, really? you don't want to do that at all. Oh my gosh. All right? You all want right. to keep it simple, maybe a Mario ringtone, <laughs> something like that. Stick to the tones that came with your phone, yeah. maybe, or maybe right? you know, Saved by the Bell. So, you know, keep that oh, simple. Oh, that's a good one. You know yeah, I, mean? I have that on my phone. Don't I tell like anyone. I, I heard, love the show. Uh, I heard that last time. I, I love the show. Yeah, right? it's a classic. So those are some of the things that you can actually do to help your battery uh, last longer, and, and okay. it'll actually be there for you when you need when it. When you need it. Yeah. Because it always dies that time when exactly. you really need your phone. Exactly. Exactly. Right? So okay. what I'm actually going to do, I'm going to show you something real quick okay. before we get out of here. So let's say this is your, your cell phone battery here. Okay. Okay. Yep. So this is the new uh, Clearberry. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. It's yeah. coming out. Uh, stores near you. All right. Look out <laughs> for it. So essentially, what happens is, I'm gonna bring my little bucket over here so okay. I don't make a mess. Okay. All right. And essentially, what happens is, this is your battery. Okay. So let's say we do regular phone usage. I'm gonna cut a small hole here. All right. Just to show you. So the water drains at a normal pace. Average level, yeah. All right. Now, on the other hand, if we were to use all those features that I mentioned. Yeah, the ringtones. The ringtones and everything. Let everything. me turn this this way. All okay. right. And cut a bigger hole right. to represent all the other applications. <gasps> look how fast the water Oh, my gosh. So look at that. That's it's a done huge difference. in no time. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. All right. And, and speaking of done, I think. We're done, too. All right. All right. So when we come back, we are going to talk about LCD and plasma. What's the difference? We'll find out after the break.